talk about what happened here in the U.S. this week. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer gave a pivotal speech and said, you have lost your way and called you an obstacle to peace. Take a listen. The Netanyahu coalition no longer fits the needs of Israel after October 7th. And I believe that holding a new election, once the war starts to wind down, would give Israelis an opportunity to express their vision for the post-war future. Chuck Schumer is the highest ranking Jewish elected official here in America, a staunch supporter of Israel. What's your response? I think what he said is totally inappropriate. Uh, it's inappropriate for uh, uh, to go to a sister democracy and try to replace the elected leadership there. That's something that Israel, the Israeli public does on its own. We're not a banana republic. I think the only government that we should be working on to bring down now is the terrorist tyranny uh, in uh, Gaza, the Hamas tyranny that murdered uh, over a thousand Israelis, including uh, some dozens of Americans, and is holding Americans and Israelis hostage. That's what we should be focused on. And as far as uh, what Senator Schumer said, the majority of Israelis support our governments. 82% of Americans support Israel instead of Hamas, but the majority of Israelis support the policies that we're leading. Uh, go into Rafa destroy the remaining uh, Hamas terrorist battalions, make sure that we don't put into Gaza instead of Hamas the Palestinian Authority that educates okay. their children towards terrorism and the annihilation of Israel, uh, and, and also uh, an enormous uh, majority here, including 99 okay. Knesset members to nine, uh, oppose the idea of ramming down a Palestinian state down our throats. I want to so, get to you know, some the majority of, of Israelis. Uh, this is a wake-up call to uh, Senator Schumer. The majority of Israelis support the policies of my government. Okay. It's not a fringe government. It represents the policies supported by the majority of the people. If Senator Schumer opposes these policies, he's not opposing me. He's opposing the people of Israel.